Now, when migrating to the cloud, in addition to migrating your network, your applications, and your databases, you need enterprise-grade file storage. And to provide that, we've partnered with NetApp to create high-performance cloud volumes for your workload needs. This gives you the same familiar file sharing experience you have on-premises in Google Cloud. And if you're looking for a Google solution, we also have you covered with a high-performance file storage option with Cloud File Store. Now I'd like to conclude by inviting Parag Agarwal, C2 of Twitter on stage, to share their migration experience to Google Cloud. Hey, Bragg. Welcome, Parag. Pleasure to be here. Can you tell us a bit about how Twitter is using Google Cloud? We operate at a massive scale with a relatively small team. Our strategy is to use the best tools to make our teams as productive as they can be. We've built a lot of infrastructure over the years to enable this. And we've open sourced a lot of it. But we found that ad hoc data analysis is a use case where we could benefit from options in the public cloud. Our data scientists constantly analyze large amounts of data. For example, to detect patterns of abuse or to understand how conversation evolves on the platform. Some of these analyses can read petabytes of data. As a result, we need solutions that are fast at scale. To support this, we're migrating several large-scale Hadoop clusters to GCP. And when I say large-scale, I'm serious. In total, we're migrating over 300 petabytes of data. These clusters are primarily used for cold storage and for ad hoc analyses, and constitute only a small part of our overall infrastructure. But we think of this migration as a really important learning opportunity for us in working with Google. Great. And you can tell us, why did you choose Google Cloud? Um, a lot of factors uh, go into making a choice of this kind, as you can understand. Uh, I want to talk about three that stood out for us. Uh, the first is performance. We did an extensive technical evaluation uh, with a bunch of our engineers over many months and found that GCP performed the best for our specific use case around ad hoc analysis. Uh, we believe that the throughput of GCP's network and storage solutions was the primary reason for this performance. In fact, the network performance was so good that we were able to decouple storage and compute. This architectural flexibility is a huge advantage for us. We can now scale storage and compute independent of each other and also run multiple data processing frameworks over the same data more easily. The second factor for us was efficiency. At our scale, costs can really add up. We have deep technical teams that drive optimizations up and down the stack uh, to drive efficiency. We found that we're able to use GCP's custom machine types to avoid resource stranding and drive a lot of efficiency as a result. Lastly, any choice of this kind requires a prediction into the future. The Google team's culture, their commitment to open source, their focus on security, all give us confidence in the future of this partnership. Great. Thanks, Prague. It's a pleasure Thanks working with me. you.